This local sports report is brought to you by Allstate Insurance, a proud member of the Waterloo community, supporting youth athletics. For a free, no obligation quote for home and auto insurance, contact one of their trusted advisors. Call Allstate at 226-444-5549 to speak with your local Waterloo Allstate representative. My first year in junior hockey was obviously last year with the Elmira Sugar Kings and it, it couldn't have gone any better for me. Brendan Anderson trying to put the Bandits on top, denied by Dawson Rowe. He made 21 saves in the game. This picture of Dawson Rowe is from the GOJHL showcase moments after the rookie goaltender recorded his first career win in junior hockey. I had a blast. Um, you know, I think part of the success um, was obviously our skill on the ice, but also kind of the camaraderie off the ice. Rowe reflecting on a positive experience last season with the Elmira Sugar Kings. The 17-year-old netminder had the fifth lowest goals against average in the entire GOJHL and was the goaltender of the month for November in the Midwest. Right from the top down, like um, Jeff Snyder, the president, all the way through the coaching staff. Rob Collins, obviously a great head coach. and and Nick Horgan was the guy, uh, the goalie guy there. Um, you know, couldn't ask for a better support system. Um, you know, nothing negative, just always pushing me in a positive way. Um, and it was a really good first year for me. Greg Brassard was Rowe's goalie partner in Elmira, and the duo were dynamite all season long. Brassard and Rowe were named the top goalie tandem in the conference. I had a great goalie partner, Greg Brassard. He was an overager, so I learned a lot from him. Um, kind of how he prepared for the games, prepared for the practices, all that kind of stuff. Uh, and he was actually a really good mentor for me. This summer, Rowe is back at the Rick Hines Goalie School in Cambridge. He's been working with head instructor Tim Fuster for a decade, developing his game. It's been a good 10 years working with Tim, um, and I don't regret any of it. He's always, he's always kind of tailoring his drills and stuff to my needs um, and this facility that he built. Um, you know, really helps with that too. And I've, I've been in here this summer, last summer. Off the ice, Rowe is working out at depth training in Waterloo, preparing for the upcoming season. Rowe says Neil Martin and Justin Brooks from depth have been a big part of his success. They run really good programs there and it's been a little different this summer because of the pandemic, but you know, they were doing everything they can. They were running field sessions outside when they weren't allowed to be in the gym, opening up the gym with with other restrictions and, and masks and stuff and just doing everything they can, sacrificing everything that they can just to get the kids in the gym and, and keep them working hard. For more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.